Hey everybody, Jason here with Premier Guitar. We're at the Dunlop booth with Daryl. How's it going? Uh, good, man, good. Seems like we meet at the same spot every year. Every year, same <laughs> spot, same bat channel, same bat time. There we go. This year you, you guys have a couple new bass pedals. All right, Daryl, tell us a little bit about how the vintage bass octave came to be. Uh, well, we work a lot with uh, Michael League from Snarky Puppy, and he's kind of one of the guys that really uh, is in the bass octave, and he wanted something that captured that vintage kind of old school brown box sound, uh, you know, with the second octave below. So we worked with him, and of course, uh, Bob Seger, our, our head designer, and we took our basic uh, MXR bass octave deluxe and added the second octave below, still got the same excellent tracking, um, it's got the uh, mid boost which gives you a little more focus and point to the note. Uh -huh. So it's just a super versatile pedal in that you've got one octave below, two octaves below, superior tracking, lightweight, small footprint, and it just sounds kind of badass. Yeah, yeah. Alright, let's hear a little bit like you were playing it before and then we'll switch the, the mid, mid switch on. First octave by itself. And the tracking is really, you know. Really great tracking, um, tone is killer. What'll be the, the price and availability on that one? Uh, those are available now, and the street is 159. 159? Mm -hmm. All right, next to that we have uh, the Dynacomp now for bass, so tell us about this one. So it is a uh, Dynacomp for bass, which we've never done before. Uh, the original Dynacomp, the red box is, it, you can use it on bass, but it's super squishy, so you, yeah. it's more difficult to get a really, uh, transparent kind of compression which is what bass players often want um, this is great because you have uh, a separate clean that you can dial in so uh, you've got the unaffected clean channel yep. along with your compressor sig compressed signal so you get a little more transparent in. sound right also the uh, tone knob is set at around 1k because with compressor you tend to lose a little bit of the top end so you can dial that back in uh, there's a push button to switch between a slow attack time and a, a faster attack time. So you could just get a really yeah. punchy um, kind of uh, compressed signal without losing your dynamics. Yeah. All right, let's hear a little bit of it.
All right, Daryl. So what will be the pricing and availability on the Dynacom? These will be shipping uh, mid-February, yep. and the street is going to be 149 Excellent. All right, Daryl. Thank, thank you as always. Thank you very much. You're going to play us out. This is Jason Shadrick with PremierGuitar.com.